Got to lay a strike. And they're off in the Timonium Juvenile. Determined driver squeezed back a bit of the start. Dancer Green's headed out to the early advantage. And uh, on the inside, there is Frosty the Giant. Frosty the Giant now a half-length advantage early. Dancer Green settles right outside of that. Jubal with a twist is three wide of the first turn run. Sweet Saudi J. Saving ground there in fourth. A determined driver is worked up into fifth position, followed by Grumpy Brooksy. And Cutalea Strike is trailing this bunch as they move now with about three and a half furlongs left to go. Frosty the Giant leads the way. The opening quarter mile, 23.22. Jubal with a twist on the outside. Dancer Green working a bit harder in between horses. And Sweet Saudi J is right there at the rail, close fourth, a length and a half or two from the front. Back to Determined Driver next as Grumpy Brooksy has to pick it up and outrun his Catalea strike. 46.99 was the half mile. Frosty the Giant, the leader, Jubal with a twist on the outside. Sweet Saudi J just waiting down on the inside for a bit of racing room as they reach the top of the stretch and they make the turn for home. Sweeping up on the extreme outside there. Moving up forward is Determined Driver, who's overcome a poor start as Sweet Saudi J slips through on the rail and on to victory. Sweet Saudi J, Determined Driver, Frosty the Giant trying to salvage third, and Juba with a twist in the show photo. Kind of like a strike. And they're off in the Timonium Juvenile. Determined driver squeezed back a bit of the start. Dancer Green's headed out to the early advantage. And uh, on the inside, there is Frosty the Giant. Frosty the Giant now a half-length advantage early. Dancer Green settles right outside of that. Jubal with a twist is three wide of the first turn run. Sweet Saudi J. Saving ground there in fourth. A determined driver is worked up into fifth position, followed by Grumpy Brooksy. And Cutalea Strike is trailing this bunch as they move now with about three and a half furlongs left to go. Drosty the Giant leads the way. The opening quarter mile, 23.22. Jubal with a twist on the outside. Dancer Green working a bit harder in between horses. And Sweet Saudi J is right there at the rail, a close fourth, a length and a half or two from the front. Back to Determined Driver next as Grumpy Brooksy has to pick it up and outrun his Catalea strike. 46.99 was the half mile. Frosty the Giant, the leader, Jubal with a twist on the outside. Sweet Saudi J just waiting down on the inside for a bit of racing room as they reach the top of the stretch and they make the turn for home. Sweeping up on the extreme outside there. Moving up forward is Determined Driver, who's overcome a poor start as Sweet Saudi J slips through on the rail and on to victory. Sweet Saudi J, Determined Driver, Frosty the Giant trying to salvage third, and Juba with a twist in the show photo. Ashes, Sweet Saudi J gets the job done in the Timonium Distaff now, or, or Timonium Juvenile rather, a perfect two for two lifetime. Joined by Cash and Trainer Ray Ginter. Congratulations, guys. Thank you, thank you. This one, this one's really sweet because this one grew up on my farm. I was so this say, is fun. I was gonna say, um, you've known him since he was born. What was he like as a young horse, and has he moved forward as a two-year-old? You know, he's he seems like he's kind of a lazy horse, but he's just laid back and. But when it's time to go, he away he goes. Yeah, he's just really, really, really performing well. We're excited. We're excited about the future. 
Focus Maiden in sharp style at Colonial Downs, then had a grass workout three days after that. What was that all about? Well, there was uh, actually, we was just out there wanting to see if he liked the turf. And he he run off, and the clocker got him, and that's how the that's how that worked out. He it was unscheduled work. What was the plan going into today, and and did he get the, the kind of trip you uh, you expected? Yeah, I don't think he got a good trip. He was in the rail in the beginning, and uh, got, you know, kind of got knocked in the rail, and then he had to come up the rail. There was very little room. Amazing ride, but not the best trip. Great horse, great horse, great great trip, great. Great, great courage for uh, Barbosa to come up the rail. It, there, there wasn't a lot of room in there. Yeah, definitely a doing move there by Jaron. Um, what's it like to watch a horse who you held breed win a stakes race here at Timonium? Well, this is the first time, and it's exciting. It's exciting. I'm, you know, yeah. My, my, my wife is who's actually the owner. My wife, um, but she's in she's in Kentucky. She couldn't make it, but she's she's in my ear on the earpiece, and she's going crazy. All right. All right. Congratulations, guys. Thank you. Thank you. It's Lynn Cash and Ray Ginter with Sweet Sadie J, the winner of the Timonium Juvenile.